Hey, I have more tables for the South African Nationals to show you. And this is the morning of, so uh, the, the players are going to go to the event now. They are starting in a few hours. And I am recording this and sending it out so that you guys can see what's happening. Um, let's go and see what it is that Rudy has sent me. Right, here we have the first table. Really nice, lots of uh, line of sight shenanigans going on here with the houses. The forests are also providing some cover here. We have a large ruin of a church here. Really cool setup. I like it. Here we have a very sparse table, especially on one side. This corner here is very open. You do get some uh, linear obstacles, hard cover, but this side is, is way better if you want line of side blockers, right? And we have, of course, two forests, three forests on this side, so I would pick this side to deploy in if I was deploying on this table. Here we have another table. Again, it's a city. We have the city map. We have certain areas that are forests. We have rows of houses that are blocking line of sight. These two ruins are, are key if you get this side up here, I think. Really nice house. I love this when they do the uh, faded uh, French uh, restaurant signs and stuff. I was just in France this summer, and it's it's it still looks like that. <laughs> so it, it really is realistic here. Oh, here we go. Oh, that was not the end. Here we have another with the automobile. Really cool little tank station here. And ruined. That's the ruined church we saw before. That is the desert table. Oh, barbed wire. One thing that is a saving grace for this side is that these walls are very tall. Um, and if you play this whole area as a ruin, that would mean that it's also line of side blocking, but I don't think they're gonna do this. I think they're just going to play it as walls, but still. That would give you something to hide behind over here. Here we have the ruins from the uh, base set from Warlord Games here. A row of houses down there. We saw this earlier. like it that they have blocked the roads here with a few tank stops so that the tanks can't just run down a road. That is key to getting a good table to work. Right. That is it. That's what I have for you today. Good luck to all the players today, and uh, I will get back to you later with some results. Cheers.